G'day you Rodlob, welcome back to the channel. Thank you for tuning in today. Today's video is a little bit of a selfish one, a little bit self-indulgent. I have had this Boss IR2 amp and cabinet for a while now, and I've seen a few videos online of guys putting aftermarket um, IRs into it and getting some pretty cool turns out of it. So today I went on a little bit of a uh, shopping spree on the internet, uh, and I ended up on a website from uh, some guys called own hammer uh, they seem to be very good at making IRs or IRs from what I the research I did with headphones on today they sounded amazing and then through the studio monitors they sounded amazing as well so I bought myself a little packet they were $19 uh, or 20 bucks American which was about $31 Australian there's sort of five or six different amp cabs in there lots of different mic combinations of each cabinet and then different blends of cabinets and then different blends of microphones and cabinets so there are thousands of IRs in there it's an absolute bargain for them to sell these for 20 bucks uh, US I think it's um Pretty cool. All right, so today I've just sort of picked a bit of a selection of them. Now again, I'm not bagging the IRs in the uh, Boss IR2. I think they're amazing. I am on the high gain channel today, so number seven, I'll wiggle my mouse around seven there, so you can all see what's going on. So, this is the stock IR that came with it. It's a Celestian IR. I actually really like it. But I figure the high gain amp is a good place to uh, try out some new cabs. It'll sort of hear a lot of the frequencies nicely, I reckon. And as they're uploading, I'm just gonna play a chord and hold it so you can actually hear the difference when it ticks over. And at the end, I'll play them all for you back to back so you can hear the difference between them. All right, so that's the stock cab. Now, I've made a folder on my desktop here. You just click on this button, this Upload, download button. The first one I've got uh, is a Fender 1x12 cabinet. Ooh. Now, just for the record, I've tuned up 15 times. It is very, very hot today, so uh, we're all just going to have to be a little bit out of tuning on a little adventure together. Mind you, it sounds good there, but here, not so good. I'm going to be playing lots and lots of E chords at you all today because, you know, we're sort of listening to the IRs, not to the guitar playing. That one sounds great. I won't talk over the next one while it's changing so you can hear it. Um, the next one is based on a uh, Vox 2x12 Fawn cabinet. Did you hear it change over there? They do actually make a pretty big difference, don't they? The next one, uh, this is a Marshall uh, Marshall 4x12 tall cabinet. Now, this is the bold version. So this has a little bit of bold mids. It's a nice sounding cabinet as well. Now the next one is the same cabinet with a bit more bass. Yeah, so all the bold IRs that are in the packet are sort of mid-focused. The, uh, the chunk ones are sort of a bit more bottom-focused. With... Next one that I chose, uh, this is the Mesa Boogie, I'll put the bold one in first, the Mesa Boogie bold one. Now 
I'm really excited to see what the chunky one's going to sound like. Oh, nothing, because I put it in slot number eight instead of slot number seven. All right, here we go, the chunky one. Oh, yeah, a small difference here. I'm sort of really interested in this is one of the mixtures the mixed ones uh this is the vox cabinet mixed with the marshall cabinet and a couple of different uh, microphones all at the same time be interesting to hear the difference when this swaps over <laughs> getting used to it, I'll just put the 1x12 fender back in. Right, now I'm going to go and edit these all together back to back so you can all hear what they sound like. There you go i hope you found that useful um if you're looking at getting some irs let me know how you go i've also bought a uh, celestian package today so i'm going to do pick select a few different speakers and try that in here as well if you've got any cool irs that you know that you think i should check out please let me know down in the comments and i will buy them and uh see how we go um good on you boss for making such an awesome pedal and good on you own hammer these guys have put some serious serious time and effort into these IRs, so um i'm glad to actually give them my money i think they'll be a great addition to uh my hx stomp as well so it'd be awesome thank you for tuning in if you got this far uh like and leave a comment and subscribe and all that good stuff we really appreciate anything you do it helps the channel out a lot i'll see you in the next video bye